going on everybody? Welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. We've been training tons here in this new block of Tartarus, which frankly I'm already sick of. It just... I don't know. Looks like some kind of weird robot. Not that there's anything wrong with robots! Let's just move on. There's a weird door. And supposedly, this one is different than the previous Monad door. I don't know why. And I'm very excited to see what's up. It seems like it won't open. Do you see anything that I'm missing? Uh, a major arcana card I have on me is reacting. Which one? The door's glowing. The why all of a sudden? Did you do something, leader? Maybe it's a, it's a funny little card. A tarot card you have is reacting to the door? Maybe that card acts like a key. Interesting. This door certainly works differently from the others we've seen. Oh. Okay. Monad Passage is a type of monad door leading to the depths of Tartarus. There's only one monad passage per block. Each opens with a major arcana card. There's formidable shadows inside guarding valuable items. And sure they will remain primarily for the same floor. Eh. Okay. If you match, consider revisiting. Does that mean there's ones for the previous blocks? I guess there has to be. Weird. Well, whatever. You think about it, like what what is the the significance behind the key of the, the being a card? I I don't get it. I don't see any danger in your immediate vicinity. However, there might be a strong enemy further in, just like with the other doors. I feel like you're in danger. Please leave quickly. Okay. I mean, how hard could it be? Ugh. Oh no! Stairs that go down instead of up. <laughs> It leads deeper in the depths of Tartarus compared to the other doors. It's almost like it's luring us to go all the way in. It's a little disturbing. We'll be fine. Besides, we got Mothman. What do we have to fear? I thought I heard something. <laughs> That's kind of funny. But yeah, so far it's just a bunch of almost empty hallways. Not much to say, honestly. Kind of bummed out. Could've put anything in here. Oh wow, another door. Another one. Even inside the first door. It looks like a very long pathway. It's a layout I've never seen before. Please be careful. Okay, freaking. Where's the action? Come on, Atlas, all this build up. It'd be different if this place looked a little spooky, uh... but it's just more the same. The passage is separated by doors and goes even deeper. Please be careful. Oh, there we go. Now we're talking. I am curious, like, what's... It, it's just a magician. Like, he's a low rank, you know what I'm saying? Not that there's anything wrong with magicians. I sense a shadow up ahead. It looks like we'll have to defeat him to, to, to continue. It seems rather weak for a shadow inside one of these doors. I've had a feeling about this. Please be fully prepared. <sighs> I scoff. We got this. Let's do it. Come on. After beating those, uh, you know, that minotaur with relative ease, I think we'll be alright. Well, it's your time. What? It outsped us? Oh no. Oh no, I didn't guard on the main character! Crap, 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 crap. I pressed X! My bad! I don't have any magic mirrors. Oh god. What have we gotten ourselves into? Okay. Brace for impact. I sure hope I'm on Mothman. If not, we're in trouble. <sighs> can we run? Please tell me we can run. Please. I have to leave. I I got I got I got a, I got a doctor's boy. It has no weakness. Cowardly Maya. Yeah, right. What do we do? At this point, I mean, we just have to like hope and pray. Am I really? Oh, thank God we got that. We might actually just be at our match. Okay. It just did a pretty strong Megiddo attack. So is there anyone with high endurance? Mothman's our best bet. Oh, God. In that case, I don't know. Just maybe use the use a beat on the main character. We're not going to use Orgia mode straight off the bat. I'm starting to, like, think about it. Oh, God. Everyone needs a beat, don't they? Orgia mode really puts us in a tough spot. Unlike other, you know, Theurgies. Once we use that, yeah, she gets a little bit stronger, but it is not worth it in the grand scheme of things, opposed to just, you know, 
being able to control your party members. It's pretty handy. Just saying. I do like the burst damage, though. This thing is massive. What the crud do we do? It's still charmed? Oh, crap. My bad. Oh, I did it again! What is wrong with me? But, yeah, it's sort of just been charmed for, like, over half this battle. I, I don't know what's going on with that. We could probably even pop our theory. No, I don't want to do that. Because if it uses that Concentrate Megiddo again, I want to have the chance to guard on everybody. That really should nullify it. Additionally, I've just been going to the main character and, you know, popping off some heals here and there. Honestly, kind of an intimidating start, but he just stayed charmed for, like, like the whole thing. I, what? That was kind of a letdown, I won't lie. Shadow eliminated. Good work. Glad that's over. Not to be a cinch, but boy, was I wrong. Trying to catch us off guard, huh? It'll take more than that to bring us down. Anyway, is treasure up ahead, right? Let's grab it. There might be a treasure chest up ahead, but I sense an enemy presence there, too. You're worn out from battling. Don't push yourself too hard. Take some time to recoup. No, we're going. We got it. We're on a roll. Like, genuinely. I don't even think I need to grind after this. We just... We're at level 34. Oh my god. Now, it's very possible the level scaling has changed from, you know, the previous game, but... I don't know. That seems sky high to me, so I'm going to press my advantage. What do we got? Eh? Ooh, okay. That looks like a fine weapon. Mind if I use it? Well, Thank you. I don't think we're going to give it to Akihiko. I wonder if that boosts her ice damage, because if we got that at this stage of the game, I'm going to be honest, I don't think we could, we could reasonably take her off the team, because that's just a huge boon to her defenses. Is that the case, though? Freeze boost. I think that just increases... I don't know. Uh, I think that just increases the chance we get the freeze, not necessarily ice damage up. You feel me? Could be wrong about that. A memoir? Even shadows have unique traits. The more hostile ones display great strength, but can't be controlled in our current facility. We've developed the Cathedral of Time to avoid disposal of such unique specimens. What? Cathedral of Time? That's kind of wacky. Also, the Gekkon jersey there, it kind of makes sense. I'm going to be honest. Let's spice it up. You know, we're a track star after all. We got to, you know, we got to represent. <laughs> Leader, is it, is it really best to... No, trust me. I move around great in this. I'm used to it. It feels like my own skin. <laughs> oh, crap. What are we doing? Wait. Isn't that a gatekeeper from a previous block? Could be wrong. Anyway, enemy in range. Let's get it. Let's try our best, team. <sighs> okay. Okay. That's not what I was expecting. First things first. I'm the realist. Second things first. Eerie sound. Dang. Oh, we got one. Okay. And it's set up above. Oh. I think I get the gimmick. Why do you know that? That's bullcrap. God dang it. Okay, don't hit the main ca Oh, whoa, crap! Counterattack, let's go! But I think I get the gimmick here. Let's scan. We can't do that yet. The book has, or yeah, the tiara has to die, like ASAP. But who is next? Because if we play our cards right, here's the thing. We cast a debuff on this one. Then, Junpei or whoever. Hopefully Junpei. Oh, no, 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 you're kidding. Tier 3 magic! Oh, thank God, she tanked it. Okay, but this is perfect, this is perfect. All right, torrent shot. Please, please hit. Get the crit. That's amazing. We'll love to see it. It connected. Okay, just gotta make sure. Sometimes it doesn't work like that. Okay, then we shift over. This is dire. I guess. You got us. You got us, girl. It's not down, and next turn is her turn. She can cruel attack it for massive damage. Right? 231? Eh, that's alright. Do we use Theurgy then? Popping that early would be... That might be a big mistake. I know it'll do more than two... Mm. Yeah, I'm doing it. I have to. I'm thinking like Cruel Attack into Cruel Attack that might... <sighs> this is actually a tough one. I think it's just because, yeah, I, got, I mean, we, our opening turn was really bad. We're up now. 
Can we... Oh, we have our third achievement. Okay, first things first. Find a persona with no elemental weakness. It's going to be a tough call. Because I'm pretty sure that Magus has all of them. Dang it. Yet again, everyone's weak to wind and ice. Freaking... And I don't want to turn into a persona that has not a lot of endurance. 27 versus 23. Dude, I got to be fusing more, bro. This ain't enough. Let's... Just do this one, and then it's comedy hour. If we get all three knocked down, that will... That's not going to happen. But if it did, all-out attack, that would knock out the tiara. Can't set up. It's buffs for the physical and... <gasps> oh, my God. I need to buy a lottery ticket because I love wasting money. That's why people do it, right? Yes, sir. That's the fight. Oh my god. I got so lucky, it's not even funny. Also, I'm significantly higher level than probably you're supposed to be here, but holy dumb. That was crazy. Get rid of spear drain, it's trash. It's crazy, I'm having a blast. With specifically, the gameplay. Also, I didn't lose theirs, that, that helped. Shadow eliminated. Just now, each shadow has a designated role. Their actions were all well coordinated. A team where individuals can cover each other's weaknesses can be formidable. At least we emerge victorious. This is all because we have a particularly exceptional leader. I'll be counting on you for the next battle. Yeah, and we got stinging. You know, count, count. Uh, freaking, I'm so glad I got that knockdown. Holy dump. Because, man, yeah, all of our freaking personas have weaknesses. It's rough. I mean, that's the name of the game right now, but... Hello. That was quite the trip. We found a familiar sight beyond that imposing enemy. It seems rather secure. Would you like to open it? Hmm? This treasure chest isn't locked. What's in it? Wait, you can open it as is? Save us some trouble? We're in a rather irregular area. I wonder if there's a special feature of this place. I'm not detecting any danger, so please check out what's inside. Okay, I was about to say. If I got jumped and it was a mimic or some crap. Temperance, tarot, and book of s sandwich? That, how else would you say that? Samek. Oh... It seems the Temperance Major Arcana can now appear during shuffle time. And Temperance, next time you do a daily activity... Are you serious? Yo! By, ca by uh, having the Book of Samek, the number of Major Arcana cards attainable in a day increases by one. These are amazing mechanics. I love Tartarus. I can't believe I'm saying that. It's similar to the ones you already have, Leader. I was able to... Also reacting to the entrance. So there may be some connection there. It's possible that other doors elsewhere would react to that card as well. Uh -huh. Oh, I want to backtrack so bad and find out, but no. We have been in here for way too long. Too many episodes. At the same time, we got so much stronger as a result. And we kind of done chest. it without the moth. And also, I might as well get these. I kind of forgot. I'll be honest. But will it be enough for the next full moon shadow? I don't know. I also can't forget. I need to level up Aki. Been slacking on that. Dang, maybe I should have, like, held off on using the... Um... What What are these? I... Let's, uh... Let's just move on. Is it what I think it is? Dangerously revealing armor. It might fit you, Kari. I mean... This is also unbelievably embarrassing. I wonder if they comment on their new attire. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kun's really mature for it. <laughs> she does not care. This is so wrong. I feel like I'm doing something bad. Also, we got we got to talk about the glow up on these fists. Like, I got to start using Akihiko more just because of these things, bro. That's funny as don't. I feel like that's just the actual models for the head shrunken down. Amazing. Anyway, if you're curious on what the origins of these wacky costumes are, they come from a weird spinoff that I don't think gets enough love in the modern age of, you know, Atlas fans. Check out the game. I'll probably have more information on it in the description. I mean, it's just such a crazy story. We don't really have time to get into it. Anyway, I'm gonna get into exactly one battle. So Aki Ego levels up. Don't mind me. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I'm having so much fun. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, she didn't get the crit. Can she even crit? Oh, there she goes. We got it. Anyway, yeah. I could show off all the costumes, but let's be real. I'm just here to show off them glows, bro. Look at them things. <laughs> okay, so, man. I guess we got the clock so much longer ago. Because he's still level 28. Which, I mean, I mean by all means, 28 is not that bad, but he's still kind of underleveled. That's a bummer. Oh, well, that's enough of that. Let's skedaddle, and I should probably change out of these outfits. They are cool, and I did show them off one single time, but past that, I mean, I don't know. The Cease outfits are just so iconic to me, especially the new ones. Look at this crap. Oh, wait. Crap. It's the old one. Slight difference, but yeah, much better. We should also uh, yeah, turn this in. We have a lot to get to. I feel like this episode just started, but it truly did not. And not gonna lie, Lizzie. Monad, pretty great. I'm impressed. Well done. The Monad Passage you explored seemed to be slightly different from the usual doors you've encountered. While they may both house strong shadows, the passage seems to lead deeper into the depths, thus harboring even more powerful shadows. But the rewards you reap are far greater. <laughs> By defeating all the shadows within the passage, you will gain a new major arcana, which in turn will aid your growth. I won't force you to undertake this task, but I do hope you continue to challenge these passages whenever you can. Those of us who reside in the Velvet Room are always pleased to bear witness to your growth. That will also bring me one step closer to filling my true desire. So embarrassing. <gasps> oh, my apologies. I didn't intend to take so much of your time babbling. Please take this as a reward. Hey, thanks a lot. Get back to uh, fusing real soon. Let's, yeah, let's just turn these in just for the little rewards. Wonderful. Lord knows I need to recover some of my healing. Because, God, we did a lot in this, like, one session. Also rescued everybody, so don't fret about that. We went over that in the TT time. Stands for Tartar's Talks. I don't know if it's going to be a recurring theme. I just, I just want to do that one time. Unless I did. Two days till the full moon. Are we ready? I feel ready. I don't know about you. Who is it? Ooh. Fuka Bazooka. Sorry, I know this is out of the blue. But if you don't have any plans, we could go somewhere together. I've been... I've been... Same time, though. When was the last time I hung out with Yuko? It's been a minute. I do need to make sure I have the matching persona, though. So I won't answer right away. But we'll head out real soon. I also need to... I don't know if I can check that right now, like what stage they are on their social link. Crud. Oh well, all in due time. Oh. You got something for me? Good day. Again? I humbly request you escort me somewhere once again. Oh. This time I'd like to visit a certain area known as Iwatodai. If you have the time, then please come fetch me as long as the sun is out. I, yeah, we can do that. I don't think Yuko would be upset. Where's the, oh. There it is. Yeah. Let's uh get it done. Ask her out. My. I've been waiting for you. Shall we be on our way? I guess. Oh my effing god. <laughs> Looks way better in this version. <laughs> Quite the workout. These treadmills sure are exhilarating. Flowing stairs that pose an obstacle to those who dare to reach another floor. This is an escalator. A simple contraption at first glance. But one false step will leave one mired in an exhausting ordeal. You're not wrong. To all customers, for your own safety and the safety of others, please do not move in the opposite direction of the escalators. Thank you. Dang, you got called out. Oh my. Don't be embarrassed, you didn't know any better. It seems that these customers may come to harm. We'd best exercise caution ourselves. <laughs> just so oblivious. And what is this? Please watch your step. There is a pitfall just ahead. Oh yeah, there. Wait, oh, is it off screen? Where is it? Show me the way. You're an attendant, right? Uh. What is this? Why, it's right over here. I guess they're working on the sewers or something? I don't know. There, in the center of this fenced off area. It's marked with eye-catching signs, proclaiming in bold print, do not enter. Humans are frequently drawn to what has been forbidden. 
This is a crafty snare, one that defies the common notion that pitfalls must be hidden. Flowing stairways, pitfalls employing high-level psychological tactics. Human authorities truly go to great lengths in their quest to preserve the town's law and order. You know, I guess they kind of do. I'm very moved by their I, dedication to the cause. I mean, it's their job. Let us carry on. Our thoughts with the unsung heroes who give their love and lives to this town. She's such a fan of civil servants. I, I had no idea. Oh. Oh. Uh, I, I guess you like fast food? This tantalizing fragrance. Can it be? I guess everyone likes salt and potatoes. Huh. Wait, nope, cheese. Ah! Uh. Whoa! You can figure out our secret ingredient with just a whiff? Wait, what is it? I guess you got a funky sense of smell to go with your funky sense of style, lady. Well, there ain't a law saying takoyaki shops can't cook other stuff besides octopus. Wait. What is it? What is in these things? So, how about it? Wanna buy some? I swear my takoyaki's so good it'll make your jaw drop. Cuisine so scrumptious that one's jaw can drop off. <laughs> I imagine that would warrant urgent medical care, realistically speaking. But I would very much like a taste. It's worth the risk, I guess. Uh? Unfortunately, this is all I have on me at the moment. I do hope this is sufficient. Where should your other money go? All right. Huh. It's not that expensive. I, I would get her some. You're buying that many? How much is she giving? What the dump? I have yet to see someone who has actually lost their jaw. That must mean that the ordinary citizen cannot easily afford these. <laughs> oh, upon closer inspection, a single serving is only 400 yen. Oh. What's going on? Well then, two orders of your finest takoyaki, please. Thanks. Here you go. And come again. Well. This distinct texture, the firm, chewy skin. There's no doubt about it. What's in these things? Come on, I'm dying to know. I must say, I'm surprised to see this used as a cooking ingredient. What the heck is it? So, how's the jaw? It has a, you know, are you getting what you got paid for? It has yet to even unhinge. Ah, oh, disappointment. But for the better, I suppose. There are many other delicacies I must try. It wouldn't do to lose my jaw before sampling each and every one of them. There appear to be several dining establishments around here. We must simply visit all of them. Dang, girl, you can eat. My first priority is to go to something called a net cafe, where one may use something called a soda fountain. Oh, that's just going to make a joke about nets. This apparatus allows for an infinite combination of flavors by mixing various solutions. Just thinking about it gives me a sort of electric tingle across my tongue. So, like, are you, are you gonna. Can I have the other one? I see. Oh, she's, a, she's a drinking from the fountain. My. Oh. Oh, my. Oh. How intriguing. Dang, this is a heck of a date. He's taking you everywhere, Lizzie. Oh, his stomach hurts. <laughs> we appear to have exhausted every dining option in this area. Yeah, I guess we have, huh? Oh, dear. Is something the matter? Now that I think about it, you haven't eaten much since our seventh meal. Seventh? In any event, I must thank you for your delightful company. I shall certainly savor this experience. If you don't mind, I'd very much appreciate it if you were to escort me again sometime. My God, the things we do for what's even our reward again? I forget. I just do these because they're silly. Are you accepting I guess that's a reward in of itself. But no, actually, we get the Book of the Ancients. <gasps> well, thank you for showing me around Iwatodai Station. The fascinating rides. We went on rides? Oh, the escalator. The dangerous traps. And of course... The cornucopia of curious cuisine. Marvelous. The way people went about their lives. There was quite different from those at Polonia Mall the other day. 
so that I might not forget what we saw. I'd like to create some of the dishes we have sampled. <laughs> First, I must hunt for ingredients. Ah, this will be so much fun. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. And now we can make Thoth. He got a book and he a baboon. That's, 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 that's pretty much all he's, you know, all he's about, you know? Anyway, what are we doing again? Oh, right, Yuko, my bad. Now we just pray to God. Yuko does not want to go to the takoyaki stand or this is going to get awkward. Sorry about the other day. I shouldn't have forced you to be a coach. Oh, with the kiss? I don't give a dog. Like, today's on me. Eat as much as you want. Wow. You're buying, then I'm eating. Holy. You know, I've been kind of second guessing my decision. Maybe I should have thought about it more carefully before agreeing. Sure, I'm a team manager and all, but I don't know if I'm ready to coach. Fifth graders? Uh, what do you think? Hmm. No, you're very responsible. Also, uh, can I get another serving, sir? Uh, please. Thank you. Aw, I really appreciate that. Hey, that's a lot of rice. I, I'm going to read up on how to get better at w running. <laughs> I mean, I want those kids to win, right? She's doing all she can. You could even say she's a superman. She's not, but you could say that. Better get my daily nutrients, too. Yeah, I feel that. Not the craziest workout today. I don't even know what happened. Yesterday, trash. Today, I am invincible. So I could use some nutrients. Sup, dude? Day after tomorrow is the full moon, huh? I'm already getting fired up. Let's kick some booty. You got it. Should be all right, I imagine. I mean, hmm. Let me think about that, actually. Uh, well, 36. That is sky high. At the same time, though, I think I can make a really strong persona. Well, really strong is subjective, but eh, I want to bring him in, so I'm going to go make him. I think. I thought she'd like to know. Karamara's condition has seemed to have been improving. Yes! Oh, an audible and visual fist bump. Very good. We have a diminutive figure, but he's a fighter. He should do well to learn from his example and stay vigilant in our own endeavors. Yeah, we don't get joned by shadows either. Training during the season's really exhausting. I'd like to wring a bit more range and movement out of my body, but maybe I should stop and rethink my pacing. Hmm, why go for that far? Maybe chill out for the summer. If you told me that, I would react negatively, so I'm gonna be like, no, you, why are you going so far? Why are you going so ham? <laughs> Come stronger. After all, the shadows are getting tougher. Procedural difficulty and everything. You know, that's not how you read the books, I guess. <laughs> Yo, so, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> so mean. Last month's operation didn't go so smoothly because the enemies were behaving erratically. So I'm going to do some visualization training and exercise to ensure that doesn't happen again. I'll do my best to support everyone. By visualization simulations, do you mean video games? <laughs> what was that? It's honestly hot as heck! At least I'm one cool dude. Anyway, you can always count on me, right? Anyway, has got nothing on me. Oh, for sure. And, okay, it's only him available. Tempting. Very tempting. A new DVD. I really want to continue this. Let's hang, girl. Let's get into it. This series always has such crazy plot twists. When the main girl's best friend betrayed her, I was like, what? <laughs> Being backstabbed by the one person you trusted most is just horrible. What would you do if that happened to you? Hmm. I'd never recover. Forgive and forget. It's whatever. I don't want to pick that, though. I want to be genuine with you, Kari. I don't know. Not to be dramatic, but... I mean, never recover? Oh, I'm overthinking because it's Yukari. Forgive and forget. It's done. You know? That's awfully admirable. You sound just like the main character. <laughs> to be honest, there was once a girl I was close to uh, who suddenly started avoiding me. New lore? It wasn't a full-blown betrayal or anything, but I was so hurt by that. It's hard to forgive and forget. Yeah, I didn't say it was easy. Oh, ah! Shit, it's starting. Frick. It's so fast-paced, we really need to pay attention. Dang. 
There it goes. Oh, no way. <laughs> it's just going to end like that? <laughs> These producers are just the worst. Ugh, it happens every time. But they're so good at leaving you hanging. I know, right? It's like they, they plan the cliffhanger first. Those dastardly demons. I need to know how it ends. Let's watch more next time, okay? What a miss it. But give me the charm boost. Wait, ah, oh, I didn't read that. So something like acting like an adult. I'd say he acted like an adult then. Pretty much. It's getting pretty late. We better head back to our rooms. Not a bad time. We even learned a lot of, like, something new about Yukari as a result. I wonder what happened. It's best not to pry, you know? We don't really need to know, but we know the end result. That's what best. Oh, we got a few messages. <sighs> okay, okay. This is tricky. I think it's gotta be Kaz. No offense, Kenji, but yeah, I also gotta make sure I have the matching. I swear, I don't think it actually matters. But I don't wanna, t I don't wanna test my luck. It would suck to get so far in this project and then we miss out on one or two social links. I can't have that, man. And while we're here, we might as well try and craft a new persona. And yeah, I'm gonna be just upfront with you guys. Uh, look this one up, because I'm gonna figure it out. So let's fuse Rakshasa and Ma. That's not it. What the social looking it up? God dang DLC personas. As I was saying, we need to first create a high level strength persona. Jigoku Ten will work, I guess. Sadly, this will sacrifice our Mothman. But I'ma summon him back. Don't even worry. It will be a little expensive, but I think it's worth it. We. I don't know if we necessarily need Megiddo. It would be kind of nice, but yeah. Nice dash. My mission is to protect and defend the world. I shall serve as your strength to help you achieve greatness. Now we bring back Mothman, and good God, that costs a lot of money to create. Please work. Yes. King Frost. It's going to come out and say it. This is our next Theurgy skill. Unless something changed. And if that's the case, my bad. But... Yeah, we're gonna pass on Getsu Eye. Critical rate boost, maybe? I don't honestly know yet. Let's figure it out as we go. There's a lot of ways we could build this guy, but, well, we already know we want him for the full moon. And what else do we do? Critical hit boost. Single target boost is pretty nice. Then, I mean, we have Mitsuru for Rakunda, but maybe I don't bring her? And then Zyonga. Yeah, just to cover two elements. And then we'll see what he gets after that. Not gonna lie. Leveling up, you know, multiple social links at a time definitely increases the viability of other Arcanas. Like, I wouldn't have done this in the past, but... Hee-ho! I'm King Frost. Your hee-ho is my... Wait, your hee-fo is my hee-fo? I'll freeze everything in your way, ho! Thanks a bunch. Here he comes. But yeah, I don't know if they've added new fusion spells. I mean, theurgy spells. Same crap, different day, different day but, uh... Ooh... Hmm, I think I will get rid of Rakukaja for that, because that might come- Aw, oh, dang it, but he learns from Rakukaja. Oh, that's such a pain. Okay, in that case, we'll get rid of Mabafula, because I don't really need that, and he eventually learns no lies. Cool, right on. And a skill seems to be on the verge of changing. Will you see it through? No, I- But Johnny, you said I gotta- See it through. Fine. Oh. Hey, that could have been that could have been way, way worse. I'll take it. Anyway, yeah, I wanted King Frost for the next full moon operation. Cause I don't know if Mothman can handle it. No offense, he's got a weakness or two that I don't really know if I want against our next foe. I'll say, yeah, what were you doing again? Did I even get a chariot persona? I'm pretty sure I already had one. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Dude! My knee just keeps getting worse. The stairs are killing my knee! Man. Why do we even bother anymore? What's the point of going on through this pain just to win? Uh... For your nephew, man, don't forget! Endure! Got it. Yeah! If I give up now, he might never find the courage to walk on his own two feet! I can barely deal with my own problems right now. Can I even help him with this? Oh. He's lost in thought, even though to the majority of us, the answer is simple. 
but he's not the majority of us. Guess all I've got now is my last resort. Divine intervention! After we finish eating, I'm gonna stop by the shrine. Make sure to toss in more coins than usual when praying. <laughs> That'll fix it. <laughs> oh man, I'm rooting for him. But yeah, in kind of a messed up way, we're not gonna spend too much time with everybody. Just like a little date here, a little date here for our class social links, because we don't get to see them during the summer. Other than Nozume, he's available, I'm fairly sure. Oh hey, tomorrow's the full moon. Are you ready? Oh yeah, ready to go. Me too. Aside from being ready mentally, you have to get physically prepared too. Be on standby in the dorms tomorrow. Let's give everything we got tonight. All right then, let's do our best. Ah, oh, dump, I forgot, I gotta go shopping. Friggin' yo! You got some sales for me? I could really use them right now. Yeah, I've got something for you. Here you go, it's a token of gratitude. You rescued her, huh? I wanna ask questions. I mean, in a different franchise, those are valuable, I guess. Hey, there's more. I found the missing schoolboy the other day. I tried questioning him. We rescued a schoolboy? I guess we did. Shift boost? What is that? Good to see you. I don't know what that skill card is. Oh, whatever. Let's see how much material we get. Oh, thank God, we're back. Okay, we're so back. I guess his armor is very defensive, but also very expensive. Understandable, because, I mean, it's... God, how heavy must that stuff be to drag out of here? As far as, like, our accessories, I feel like we're good. Weapons, they can't come in handy, but I don't think we're going to get any, like, all-out attacks. So, spend the rest of our budget just, you know, on medicine. Because we're probably going to need a lot of that. And one last stop. Let's get that academics up. Call it a night. Alternatively, we could have spent some time cooking with Aki and as much fun as that would have been. Just not the optimal play. Sorry to say. But today's the day of the mission. Let's get at it. Save our full strength. Ooh. So will the King Frost be enough? I mean he's pretty good. What's oh, I don't know. Well here we are. A full moon once again. Yeah, at all the time in the world. I only fused like two personas. <laughs> Any luck, Yamagishi? Yes, I can sense it. There's a shadow reading tonight, as expected. That's what I'm talking about. It's located by the deserted houses in the northern part of Iwatodai. But there's something strange. The reading is coming from underground. Almost ten meters. Maybe it's in some kind of basement? According to the records for the northern harbor, there are no structures that match that criteria. However, there once was an underground facility used by the military. The military? Is that true? Well, the architectural and geographical data for the area was uploaded into her memory. Then again, the information hasn't been updated in ten years. Correct. The data is ten years old. Shouldn't someone fix that? <laughs> So how exactly do we proceed? No time today, I guess. Mm, I guess get a shovel. We're digging underground. We won't know more until we actually get there. Old relics of war. It seems the situation is still unclear at this time. With that in mind, we'll wait until we arrive before we decide who should be deployed. Agreed. Understood. All right, let's go. Whoa. Iwatodai Northern Harbor. Underground facility entrance. I didn't know there was a place like this so close by. Target should be around here somewhere. Oh, <laughs> well done. Who are they? Lucia couldn't sense them at all until now! It's so nice to finally meet you in person. My name is Takaya. This is Jin. We are known to some as Strega. Now then, we've been keeping an eye on your activities for some time. From what we hear, you've undertaken a righteous battle to save the world. Unfortunately, we've come here tonight to put an end to that. 
What did you say? You've gained many new allies in such a short time. No doubt because this land crawls with sin. Ah, Tartarus is towering as beautifully as always. You know... Wait, why the hell would you want to stop us? <laughs> it ain't rocket science. If shadows in the dark hour disappear, we could lose our power. And that's not something we can abide by. Get it? Power? Are you saying you're Persona users too? I implore you to think more carefully. Do you really want to lose your abilities? Not just anyone can wield the power of a Persona. The Dark Hour is a frontier that is ours alone to explore. And the same goes for the Tower of Demise. That's your reason for stopping us? Then you're the ones who need to think. Who knows what might happen if we don't do something? A catastrophe brought on by the shadows. What difference does it make, really? Disasters will always exist. And humans will always destroy each other, regardless of what the shadows do. Either way, no one can predict what misfortunes will befall who. But more importantly, it's time you accepted the truth. Surely you will acknowledge the sense of fulfillment the Dark Hour has given you. Yeah, do you think I like this? Is it not so? How about the rest of you? Do you also wish to return to your pathetic ordinary lives? Huh? I don't enjoy this at all. Whatever. You all got your own selfish reasons for fighting. That so-called justice of yours? <laughs> Ain't nothing but an excuse. There's nothing righteous about any of you. You're all just hypocrites. Like hell you chumps are gonna stop us. What did you say? Uh, interesting strategy. <laughs> Have fun in there. Oh yeah. Dang. Damn it! They locked us in. There is no need to panic. Instead of wasting resources, I recommend we prioritize the shadow first. Great. If we freak out, then we're just giving them what they want. Shadow's moving. I think it's noticed us. All right, let's focus on our original goal. We can look for a way out after we've won. Go ahead and select your team. Everyone, prepare for battle. Right. That shadow. It's trapped in here with us. We're not trapped. Hit. Oh, oh, honey, shut the. Mm. Give me a minute. Leader, stop dancing. You have to... That's a different game. Please focus. There's a slight accident, but let's focus on the mission. I feel the target's presence. Far from beyond that door. Once you're ready, we can go. Right. Who to bring in to the battle against the large shadow? I've already decided, but I want to have dramatic tension. So see you next time. More Persona 3 Reload. Bye.